everybody this is your girl EJ and really quickly I found this very cringy video on the internet and I want to share it with you the problem is that I told you to come at 2 p.m. and you came at 204 four minutes late I'm not used to this kind of delay for me it's not possible huh? to have a relationship where my partner is not showing up on time okay so from what I gathered and sometimes my gathering be wrong so we're gonna leave a space for error right from what I gathered this is a couple. This is boyfriend and girlfriend. Baby, he said be there at 2. She had the audacity to be there at 2.04. He don't like when people be late. Initially, when I saw this, I was like, oh, they could be business partners. But her body language and her feedback, and by feedback, I mean she didn't say nothing, was giving, okay, we were dating, but we're not after this. The energy wasn't giving business partners. Here's the thing. If you're a stiffler for time, and that's really important to you, and the people that can't respect time boundaries, you gotta cut them off. Let me just tell you um, right now, just I don't wanna be friends with you cause I be late. I'm working on being on time more often, right? But I'm just saying I'm not there yet. I'm not even, like I'm not even next door to that place. Like this is me and on time is Wait. Why is it so hard for me to be on time? I honestly don't have the time to look into it um, cause I'm delayed in my timing even now. I just know that my word is bond, which is why when I say something, I don't really put a time on it. I just say, you know, I'll be there. We coming, we're on our way. These are generic confirmations that we in fact will be there but not including the time that will be there. It's very strategic and it, it works for me. Let me also say, like when I was working, I wasn't late for work, right? Now when I say not late for work, I mean like a lot of my jobs had a seven minute grace period and I, I would be there at the 07 mark for sure every day, day in and day out. The point that I'm working up to is that even though I got there within that seven minute grace period, I absolutely showed up 120% on the job. You were not gonna outwork me. Cause I enjoy doing a good job. I just don't enjoy getting there on time, I guess. Mm -hmm. The point is, this young man would have a serious problem with me. And the young lady did way better than me by getting there four minutes after he asked her to be there. Cause again, I'm looking at exhausting the entire seven minutes. Even though this is probably not a work situation. Work, I'm gonna exhaust the seven minutes. Personal, who it may it may be, it may be half an hour. It may be, it may be that 30 mark. But I'm coming. And I'm gonna do whatever you need me to do once I get there. Just bear with me getting there. And I'm not talking about weddings or funerals. I wouldn't be late for any of that. But you're talking about brunch, an outside event, or something casual? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a few minutes off. All right, and as always, I wanna hear from you. Girl, do you be late all the time? Or are you like the young man in the video and you can't stand when people late? Which one are you? I wanna hear all about it. Thank you guys so very much for tuning in. This is your girl, EJ, and I will see you guys next time. But I don't know what time next time. Bye.